babies need air. Go. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, you Come on, go. Oh. I know what the problem is. Do you tell me no air? No. You gotta yell, Kobe! Oh, yes. close. Kobe! Oh, that's yeah. the old problem. Kobe! Oh, you see? You right, guys, if you don't yell it, you don't get it. Right here. We're going. Oh, we're, we're never making over this, this thing in the house. Oh, my goodness. You didn't yell it. Watch, 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 watch. Jordan! Right on. God, I'm nasty. Kobe! There you see? <laughs> Let's give the people what they want. You're going to hit the top of the ceiling. All right, I'm just going to yell at the best basketball players that I even know. Larry Bird! You gotta yell their names. It's Kobe! Scary. Oh, gosh. Oh, my God. I'm about to max out with all the basketball players I know my whole life. Uh, Steph Curry! Oh, 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 that was a trick shot. LeBron Oh, there is a guy named something Jahamis or something like that. Uh, Luka Damas or something like that. I don't know what the guy's name is. I'm maxed out with people, so I'm just gonna make up names. <laughs> Philip! Oh. Here we go, this one's going right in. Bobby Bacala! Oh, he was the best. Alright, last shot. Oh man, under pressure. Welcome back, guys. So, that's not what today's video is about. I mean, I, I smoke Alex nine times out of ten playing Whoa, basketball in the street. At the court, in the basement, wherever we're at, he gets he gets owned. He, you know you do. It's not because of my height; it's just pure skill. No. But uh, today we're setting these up. My brother purchased these for uh, for well his nieces and nephews, but um, or Alex and my nieces. So no, he's got two, Luca and you. But um, what we're doing here is these are them right here. They're called Fly Bar. That was Alex. Fly Bar 12 volt bumper car XL battery powered ride ons. These boxes are pretty massive. I'll give you kind of a, uh, an idea side by side of me. Obviously there's two of them, but they're probably about two foot high. Um, they're pretty heavy. I lifted them up by myself, brought them down here. Uh, they weren't the easiest to kind of move. I'm looking to see if there's a, uh, a weight on them. I will well, just show you guys. So here it is. It says for ages six plus, Weight limit 175 pounds. They do 360, soft foam bumper, safety included, rechargeable batteries, dual joint, blah, 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 blah. So we're gonna go ahead, get into these. Again, these weren't sent to us by the company. They were sent to us by my brother uh, for his nieces and nephews, you know, for, for our nieces and uh, our nephew and Alex. You know, you guys get the point. It was sent to us for the kids. So we're gonna set it up. Um, he's right now, he's in Long Island. He's not here. Or else I, I mean, he should have really moved them himself. That's how heavy they are. But we're going to open them up, get to them, see, you know, you guys see them as, as we do. None of them are open. This is how they were shipped and stored. That's sent to us by, uh, I guess this came in FedEx. I don't actually know who brought this in. Nevertheless, let's get into it. Open this up, see what we're working with. Flags, a little instruction battery pack here. I love when things come like 99% assembled. Second 
same thing. Remove this. Little battery pack, charger, and instructions. Got a flag. Casters, giant. The whole undercarriage. I'll show you that in a second. I've never even heard of fly bar. I don't know what what, the, what else they make, what they have, but these are uh, definitely pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, they're a little bit on the heavy side, so I mean, they don't feel like cheap at all. Show you guys the bottom here. See what I was looking at. There's a fair amount of like, uh, there's a fair amount of like, White lithium on those gears. Should probably pull this off on the bottom here. It's kind of hard to do this all with. You guys see that? That's what I'm gonna pull off. Ugh. Yeah, that's that wheel. Here's the bottom. These cast these wheels here, I believe those are called casters. Let me on both sides. Really nice looking machines. Now they're currently off. Here's your on and off switch in the middle of wherever you're Kid's leg will be. Um, let's see. Attention the battery for product. It's located under the seat. Please read manual carefully. All right. So, we're going to have to read the manual, but the battery is located underneath the seat. That's what this says right here. We need to grab a Phillips head screwdriver, open that up on both of them. We'll probably have to plug it, plug in the battery. I'm sure for transport reasons, those terminals are usually blocked. We'll put them, we'll see what that calls for, and then hopefully they'll start uh, driving around the basement a little bit, give you guys a demo. Right, so we're just gonna put you guys down, because two, two hands are a lot easier than one. So here's the inside, that's the seat belt. All right. So I'm going with this terminal here, plugs into there. Everything else is ready to rock and plugged in. Just, just trying to fish it around. That's plugged in. Oh, nice. <laughs> Should probably turn the lights off. Yeah, these guys, these kids are gonna go nuts. I'm gonna put the seat back on, do the same thing to the other one. I'll be, I'll be right back. Um, I'm gonna try that millennial farmer thing. He does it, it seems pretty cool where you just, it's like everything looks like this and then you do one of these. 
Oh, guys, Zach's on to something with that. That is, that makes life a lot easier when you do that snap. It's like, I didn't even have to do anything. So here they are. Check these out. They are definitely cool. The kids are going to come down now, give them a quick demo, ride them out, ride them around down here a little bit, and then uh, we have to plug them in and charge them like the battery pack says. Carmelina, turn on that middle one. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Carmel, turn it on, babe, right here. Right here. <laughs> wait, 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 let me shut the door. <laughs> These things got a lot of power, quick. Push them forward, Carmelina, nice and easy, push them forward. So that's it, that's the fly bar, 12 volt bumper cars, the indoor bumper cars. As you see, Alex and Brielle, they fit pretty well together. They're both under, under 10. Carmelina is five years old. She fits perfect in there by herself. Two people in there would be good, where Alex and Adriana, Adriana's 12 and Alex is nine. They kind of, it's really kind of tight inside there for them. And neither one of them are bigger kids. They're both really thin kind of kids. So uh, that's it. How do you guys like it so far? Would you recommend other kids getting them? Yeah. All right, well, there you go. Now, we're going to look at the floor afterwards. It doesn't look like it's even marking, marring, or leaving any kind of scuffs on the floor. Um, they seem to really enjoy them. I'm not sure about the battery life on them. We'll check that out afterwards, and I'll let them kind of go and do their thing with that. But, uh, yeah, a little bit different video for this one. It was not sponsored. It is just an honest review, and uh, for the first about 10 minutes so far, they're really loving them. So uh, a little bit different of a video. I hope you guys enjoy. We'll see you guys on the next one.